Yo, what's going on, guys? You know, this is Juice That Makes Beer. Alright, guys, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and just upload a video, you know? Just to chill down, relax, and we're just gonna wait a minute, wait a minute. Who is calling me in this freaking late night? It is 11 o'clock, son. Let me go see who it is. Peter Parker. Why is Peter Parker calling me? Hold up, hold up. Let me call this number actually, guys. Buenos dias. Hey, man, we're not talking about those uploads, bro. You need to get okay. back to work, bro. I swear, man. You need yeah, to, bro. Yeah, man, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about the Wicked Wednesdays, bro. I know we're late to that crap, bro. Bro, you need to actually get back to Wicked Wednesdays, to to bro. Work? I think I'm people already working, missed it already, bro. It's been three weeks. You haven't uploaded that. Come on, bro. If I don't see those Wicked Wednesdays, I'm gonna go ahead and clap your cheeks and put the webs on your face with your mama. I say some such stuff. Okay, I'm finna just end this call for you. All right. Goodbye. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Jason Max here. So, yes, we have finally came back. It's been like three weeks. We have even done a wicked freaking Wednesday, dude. Three freaking weeks, bro. I'm glad we're back with this, honestly, bro. It's been a long freaking time, dude. This is our Wednesdays. I haven't uploaded a Wednesday video for a while. I really apologize. I know I've been slacking on those videos because I know I upload my serious videos so late. That's my fault. That's apologies to me. But, yeah, guys i think i just found another horror film we can watch together we can actually enjoy with ourselves and also i won't make this intro so long so i'm gonna go ahead and just stop my yapping here and y'all better go ahead and make sure to drop 25 likes in this wicked wednesday video for today and also let's go ahead and get our popcorns get our snacks and also get our waters and let's just go ahead and get straight to that. guys we're here in this video since I already explained the intro about the new video that we're actually be watching our Wicked Wednesday. It's still Wicked Wednesday, but today is Thursday, actually. But yeah, guys, today's title that we're actually going to be watching, which is called Nine Scary Videos That Will Baffle You. We're just over here just reacting to some, like, scary things, you know. I haven't done this for a while, because even though I did that criminal video, that went pretty well. I'm not going to lie to you, but I'm going to go ahead and stop my yapping here, and let's go ahead and get started. Let's go. Okay, pretty good, pretty cool intro, Sir Spooks, yes sir. What's it gonna Hello, be? Everyone. My name is Sir Spooks, and today we'll take a look at nine scary videos. Nine but scary videos. Begin, <laughs> make sure to subscribe to my channel for more scary content. Okay. All right. With that said, let's begin. Why does bro look like Michael Myers? Oh goodness, he scares me. Top nine. What's scaring this, this one? This first video we'll be taking a look at today comes to us from Reddit user known as Iggy Tolls 15 who nice shares name, the I footage over on the ghost subreddit, where it has been the talk of the community for the past few days. Alright, okay. In the video, we watch home security camera footage of the uploader simply wandering around his house and doing everyday things, when out of nowhere, something starts what? I don't know where and Randy completely ordered. ruins his day. Understandably so. Have a listen. What happened, actually? The dog's just chilling there. He's like, I'm having a relaxed day until something happens. I don't know what. Alright, I want to see what happens. Is it behind him? Why do I see his cheeks though? Oh, oh, what is my man? Wait. Oh, heck no, bro. Did the ghost send Mike? Is anybody in the house, bro? Oh, hell no, nah, bro. Nah, nah, nah. Did you hear it? Guys, if you, if I heard somebody say my name, I finna just go up there and get a ghost detector. Then I finna just vacuum the ghost. <laughs> That's what I literally would do, guys. Like, literally, if I was in that situation, I'm not even joking, bro. Out of but what is that Mike, though? An unsettling voice can Thanks, be heard no. whispering his name, Mike. Mike, the uploader, says that initially... Mike Wazowski. He believes that the voice was coming from one of his children who he assumed had just wandered downstairs. Oh, it's his kids, okay. But says that he bolted whenever he realized that that was not the case. Ooh, he that's kind of scary. That video was filmed at around 12 a.m. and says that it was just him plus the dogs and the cat that were awake at that hour. Oh, heck no, Mike bro. Also points that's out creepy. That the house is from the 1850s and a crew member whose life was taken in the infamous Halifax explosion Damn. lived in the home in the early 1900s. It's top eight. Which just makes things so much more. Oh, we're not top eight yet. Is it possible that the house is being haunted by the spirit of a man who passed away as a result of the explosion? 
Or is there know. something else at play here? Be sure to submit your theories in the comments. Top eight. What's next for top eight? Seriously, a okay. woman on TikTok named. So I'm guessing top nine was a scary ghost. Just call his name Mike Wazowski. Then Mike Wazowski went up there and then he was like, "Bro, where's the guy?" And then he just went downstairs and like do his normal thing. I guess he was scared and panicked at the same time whenever someone called his name for real. But I'm gonna go ahead and just get started here. Let's go. I'm Sierra typically posts wholesome and light-hearted videos to her account of her daily life and her exciting adventures. Her daily life? But two videos in okay. particular on her account stand out like sore thumbs. In the first video, Sierra what is she says doing? that she Working. was oh, no. filming a vlog about the brand new house that she just purchased. Bro, when she's scared a, sudden, a bit. She began to experience something quite strange. Sierra is shown standing on a ladder trying to do something with a closet dog. Uh -huh, and see. out of nowhere, this happens. Okay. What the? Did I hear breathing? Oh, heck no, bro. I heard breathing. I heard a loud ass breath, bro. What the heck? Nah, oh, G. He locked the door. Huh? Oh, no, man. That's scary, dude. What the heck, bro? What oh, the heck? I tell you, bro, ghost is real, bro. If y'all say ghost is fake, I don't know what to say to y'all. But hey, if I saw that, bro, uh, uh I'm dipping, dude. I'm actually dipping from my house, bro. Mm -mm. I take my dogs too. Another door slam. Oh no. There's no way that this is a thing. Yeah, there's a ghost in the house, bro. I don't think you understand. There is zero way that you could open. unlock that, open it, shut it, and lock it. How are you doing this? Is, she, is the dog her okay, dog bro? Outside, trying to get back inside, but Shiera did not put the dog outside in the first place. A few moments. Then she closed the door. She proceeds to continue with what she was doing before. Okay. But again, the same thing happens. She goes to check the back door, and shockingly, her dog is once again locked outside. Gotta be joking but how me, did man. the poor dog get outside in the first place? By the windows, it's a maybe? mystery that is obviously quite baffling for Shiera. Exactly. Is it possible that there is some strange spirit that is messing around with her and putting her dogs outside to give her a good scare? If so, what is the motive behind it, if any? In a second video True. from Shiera's account, she states that Again? her sister and her I guess fiance she was doing her work, were trying I guess. to paint a nursery when randomly out of nowhere, this happens. Where did you get back? The... Fiance was there too? Oh, that close by itself. Oh, no, oh, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, nah, bro. Just get out the house, bro. Nah, man. Nah, man. Nah, man. Just get out, bro. Bro, if I saw that thing close by itself, just imagine. My door closing by itself. I will actually get out this house. Even though I don't do much scary videos, that is scary, bro. Nah, -uh. I'm dipping. I'm out. Bye, bro. Bye, bro. Just, just bye. Nah. Nah, man. Those ghosts don't play, man. Don't gotta say. I would not recommend to watch this at night. For everybody that's out there, do not watch this at night. It's gonna do it again. He's gonna do it again. Watch. Wait, who's talking? Oh, again? Yep. What did I tell you, bro? What did I tell the you? The door to the room that they are painting in closes without any explanation, much to the confusion of everyone. Tell you, bro. A couple seconds go by, and Shira's sister decides to go investigate, and then, shortly thereafter, the door closes once again before the video ends. Again, bro. What could possibly be going you. on inside of Sierra's home, and why is this stuff happening if the home is brand new? It's not as though the house is decades old and there were previous tenants Probably there. is. It's quite a baffling case, so I'm curious if you guys have any theories on this story. If you do, please feel free to share them in the comments down below. Yeah. If I was Sierra, bro, 
I would have got out the house, bro. I would even, I wouldn't even try to investigate. I wouldn't even try to hurt the thing. I wouldn't even try to shoot it. I wouldn't even try to do everything. I would rather just burn the house with a lighter and go boom, put gasoline around the entire house and then boom, that's it. I'm out of the house. That's it. No, no ghosts, no nothing. We're at just out of there getting our car and then move to a new house. Just now, man. A TikTok user named Dario Bidi says that he was staying at the Appalachian Mountains overnight with his family, but okay. they did not know that it is one of the most haunted places out there. In the video, we watch as Dario is seen sitting in a nice hot tub outside in the middle of the night oh, that's to cool. enjoy himself. But while this is going on, something is terrifying Dario and his family. Although Why? they try to relax, they can't help but hear an extremely bizarre and unsettling noise coming from somewhere nearby that they cannot quite explain. And honestly, neither can I. Have a listen. What do you, what do you mean? What do you mean there's like a baffling noise? Hold up, man. I think it's a train. Oh my ears, dude! Okay, Bro, my ears hurt. I don't know why. Stop. What is out there, bro? Wait, 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 wait! I saw something right there. Hold on. Believe it or not, the noise that you're hearing in the video is not background music, but rather something that Dario and his family were hearing while out in the hot tub. Heck no, bro. Sadly. Dario says that he was never able to figure out the source of the noise, but says that he now knows that the Appalachian Mountains are very haunted indeed. Oh, so it's probably not likely that he will ever return there to stay a second night. Smart, very smart, very smart. Leave the place, bro. If you hear something suspicious in your first night on your vacation or on your trip, just head, but just head out, bro. Just don't even come back, bro. I wouldn't even come back if I was me, dude. I would just dip. I would just leave. I wouldn't even stay for longer, dude. It's gonna get worse if you stay longer. Number the six. Subreddit unexplained is home to some of the most bizarre and confusing videos that you can possibly watch on the internet. Okay. The kind of videos that will truly make you scratch your head and wonder what exactly you're looking at. And while the subreddit is Maybe filled we'll with baffling clips, knows. the one that you're about to watch, published by user. QNKO Dickens is by far one of the most baffling on the entire community. The uh, uploader writes that he was simply trying to unwind and have a smoke in the middle of the evening while on his terrace, when he noticed something up above that made him feel unsettled. Unsettled? What do you mean unsettled? It's just a bird. What's going on here? Wait, wait, wait! Look I'm a bird! Up there. Hold ah! up! I never saw this, reason, hold up. The seagulls that can be seen flying in front of the uploader seem to be flashing the color blue. The uploader writes that it looked I don't know that's like real electricity fake. was shocking. I don't know. Them, but the seagulls did not appear to be disturbed in the slightest. He also says that it wasn't someone's laser doing this either. The uploader is asking for help from the internet in trying to determine what exactly was going on with the seagulls that night. What is up with the seagulls, dog? It's one of the weirdest videos that I have seen in quite a long time. It is one of the weirdest and videos. And I honestly don't have any You're sort right of explanation that. that comes to me, at least at the moment. Let's just hope that this eerie mystery gets solved soon, because for the time being, I think a lot of us are going to remember this video the next time we see a seagull out in the wild. Yeah. Alright, bro, you were just right about number six, dude. The seagull with the blue lights. I never saw that, ever. I think it's haunted, bro. I think that seagull is corrupted or something like that. I don't know. Just head on to the next clip. Hannah Viveret has a podcast. Alright, what's this girl doing? In which she frequently posts Why is she videos dancing? of herself doing various oh dance God. routines and exercises for her half a million followers to watch and enjoy. Of course, anyone with that huge of a following is bound to have some extremely creepy people following their account. However, True. sometimes a creep takes things way too far 
Ant invades the person's Wait, what? personal space quite oh, literally, hell no, bro. which is exactly what happened here. A creep this video dude? To no, man. In November of 2020, showcases Hannah performing a dance routine while in her living room, trying to entertain and make her viewers happy. Things seem to be going perfectly well for the first little while of the video, but in just okay. a few seconds, this seemingly fun and light-hearted video takes a seriously sinister turn that you what won't you mean? expect. You got 58 million for what? Wait, 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 wait. What the heck? What's in that window, G? What's in that window, bro? Please get out. No, please get out. Yes. Who are you? Please get out of my apartment right now. Oh, no, nah, man. A creepy fan, bro. She, she, she already got her leaked address, bro. What the heck, bro? Oh, no, nah, man. If I was her, I, I had to call the cops immediately, bro. You got to get out of my casa, bro. If you're in my casa, I finna do this to you. I finna do this to you. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do to you if you're in my casa, all right? I don't want anybody in my casa, son. I don't want anybody in my casa, all right? All right, that's enough goofiness. Please get out of my apartment right now. Get out. Please 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 get out. Bro, what is wrong with this guy, bro? Oh, hell no, nah, man. Oh, he's about to get up. Oh, no. This guy's a stalker, bro. Out of nowhere, a creepy man proceeds to climb on oh, a second-story no, balcony to get inside of her house. When she notices the man inside of her place, she is obviously extremely oh. freaked out and demands the man to leave. On night, bro. Fortunately, no, it is not that easy, and he doesn't obey. He even asks her if she is friends with him, at which point she clearly tells him no and tells him once again that he needs to leave. Thankfully, oh, it's creepy, the dude. man does eventually leave, but it was not easy for him to actually listen to her. Oh, God. Sadly, it seems as though this scary incident may have freaked Hannah out so much to the point where she stopped doing TikTok videos. Something that she clearly loved doing up until this point. Thank goodness. That would have cost her video, life, bro. She only ever posted one more video a couple of months later, and that was back in January of 2021. It's just sad to think about the fact that there are people this scary in the oh, world. Oh, hell no, nah, man. That's... That's terrible. That is terrible, bro. If you're famous on TikTok, bro, you gotta watch out for the creeps. You gotta watch out for the stalkers. You gotta watch out for the haters. You gotta watch out for everything, bro. Because sometimes these people can go to your house and try to do something suspicious and kind of scary at the same time. Be careful out there, alright, guys? Just be careful. I don't want anybody to get hurt, okay? Number four, dude. Number, Number five was pretty creepy, I ain't gonna lie. Posted a video to her account where she starts it off by saying as quietly as she can that she swears that there is somebody outside of her room, despite the fact that she lives alone. She then stops talking to listen in on her surroundings. At first, the house seems to be quiet, but then out of nowhere, okay. It becomes abundantly clear that there most definitely is a visitor in Valeria's home. Oh no! There's someone else. No man. Wait. The door opened by itself. Hey. Oh no! Oh no! No. Hey. Who's saying hey, bro? Hey. No man, I heard that. Hey. I don't know. That's real fake. Why is she saying hey like three times? Can you stop repeating the words? Oh no, man. I'm glad there's no jump scares, bro. What is going on, bro? This is not good. What do I do? What do I do? An extremely creepy Try to do something. can be heard saying the word hey from somewhere close by in her home. Luckily, Valeria doesn't go out to investigate, which was the smart thing to do. In case she walked out of the room and something bad happened. Okay. She instead decides to wait a few seconds and then stands up and walks over to her open bedroom door and proceeds to close it. 
She then ends the video by asking her followers what she could do. Glad she was smart, dude. Video, she goes on to say that sometimes other creepy things happen in her house too, such as instances in which she hears her pets making noises outside of her room, oh, no, even that's when bad. they are in there with her. That's creepy, she also man. She says there have been instances in which she heard people calling her cats from other rooms, in addition to lights turning on and off all by themselves. True. A lot of people in the comments of these videos seem to be convinced that a mimic is living inside of Valeria's home. A mimic? Which definitely seems like a believable oh, no, yet man. scary possibility. One commenter said, quote, a mimic is a being that can sound like those guys. Oh them, no, man! More robotic. Bro, if I saw that inside my house, like seriously, if I saw that in my house, I would just freaking get my shotgun and just do it again. Boom! 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 That's what I'd rather just do, bro. Seriously. Don't ever listen for them. Don't go investigate. Just ignore it because they will lure you away. End quote. They're smart, yeah. I think it's good advice, not just for Valeria, but for anyone that is going through a similar situation. I have to say that's facts. A man named Tommy Wells posted video to his YouTube channel on June 10th, 2011, which seemingly Tommy showcases Wills. an ordinary birthday party gone terribly awry, quite suddenly. Oh. At the start of the video, a woman presumably Tommy's wife, is showing off the family member sitting around the kitchen, getting ready to light the candle on the young girl's cake. All right, it's so a cute what happens? moment at first, and you'd be forgiven for thinking the video is nothing more than a wholesome home video of a young girl's birthday. Uh -huh. But in just a few moments, this ordinary video turns into anything but. Happy okay. birthday, dear Christina. Happy birthday to Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, I'm around the camera. Alright. What happens? Daddy's cutting the cake. Did you like the bicycle and stuff you got for your birthday? Oh my god, Tommy, it's gonna start again. Oh my god, damn. What do you mean? Wait, 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 wait. wait. Yeah. That's around by itself. Oh, oh no. I did not cop that on the car, bro. I don't know what's gonna happen. Come on. It's ridiculous. Hey, I'm sorry, baby. Seems like it's missing everything baby. in four seconds. It's okay, it'll be alright. God, okay, we right. should have had this at Jerry's right. house. Okay, it might yeah. it's just, else, okay? this stuff is starting again. Right. Oh no, this I'm is sorry, bad. Sweetie. It'll be okay. Chris, <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh no, bro. Oh, the teacher's moving, bro, what the heck, bro? The teacher's, nah, the girl's just like, yeah, I'm dipping, goodbye, guys. Oh, man. Oh, no, nah, man. Yeah, you can just get out of there, bro. Nah. Out of nowhere, the kitchen sink begins to turn Dang, on. Dang, that just ruined itself, everything, bro. A couple of seconds later, the cabinet I will not have a birthday party like that, bro. And close repeatedly, causing the children in the room to scream. Oh, that is creepy. Despite the fact that this video is over a decade old, we have never got any yeah. sort of concrete explanations for what exactly was going on in the video. But we can only hope that this family is oh, doing man. a lot better these That's days. That's creepy. And we can only hope that the children who experienced this firsthand were not traumatized for life. If they were, but oh my goodness. Nah, man, that's just... I don't know what to say, bro. Number three, I don't know what to say, bro. A YouTube channel known as Derek's 90 posted a video to his... In a school, bro? You gotta be kidding me. Bro, that's gonna creep you, man. On May 27th, in the school, G. In which he and a friend are wandering around inside of a school that his friend asks him to go and check out with him. As he is thinking I hate school paranormal to. stuff, dude. Nah, man. He said that his friend wanted to videotape it so he could then look at the footage later with other school videos to compare them and ultimately decide which school he wants to transfer to. Mm hmm. This particular video what shows happens the duo heading inside to check out That's the bad quality, though. University, which looks to be quite nice upon first inspection. Yeah, but it looks pretty nice. Rather okay. Quickly. Quickly. It's that quality, though. They have them, and anybody can attend, and it's really nice. 
Whoa, I did not see that. Bro, I freaking jumped so bad, dude. No, man, if I saw that in this freaking school, I'm dipping. I gotta go. I gotta go. Can't stay for long for the school, man. Okay. And down here, we've got printmaking. Um... Oh, no, nah, man. Oh, no, nah, man. Uh uh. Uh uh. We'll see if there's a professor there that can talk to you about that. Sometimes they hang out during the summer. Hey, say, man, didn't you come here to do sculpture, though? That's kind of true. Um, maybe we could go look at the sculptures. Yeah, stuff. definitely. We'll go down the sculpture hallway, see if there's any classrooms open. What time uh, she appears again? Do, like, senior seminar and some student work from last semester in the classrooms. We'll see if maybe there's something left over <clears throat> for you to look at. Wait, why are they going over there? Oh, no, nah, man. There, and then these are all the art classrooms. Let's get up here again, watch. <laughs> Okay, it's not gonna appear again. At one point in the video, while on the guided tour with his friend and the tour guide, the camera pans to the right, and we can see a mysterious ghostly figure looming oh, in the a few seconds a girl. before the cameraman returns to the other point of view and continues walking forward. That's he creepy, says dude. that nobody saw the entity when the video was filmed, and they only noticed it when they eventually replayed the footage, watching it back at a later date and ultimately getting the scare of a lifetime. To the surprise of nobody, the uploader mentions that upon seeing the video, his friend has officially ruled out this place as a possible school for him to transfer to. Dang. Let's just hope that he eventually found a nice school to transfer to. Thank that goodness, bro. Any ghosts in it, preferably. I'll transfer to another school, G. Okay, what is number one gonna be? Because number two... That caught me off guard with that little girl with the ghost, man. That's all I gotta say, bro. Everything looks so creepy in that school. I would just, I would rather just transfer to a new school. That's it. Let's see, what's number one? Oh god, not these videos. Oh no. Hill is once again heading out hey, at least hit the gem though. Some of the that's world's good. Most terrifying and haunted locations. Oh no, nah, man, and that's this time, creepy. He is venturing back to the over 90-year-old Robert Fulton School. Which he previously visited in the past. Oh, I hate, no, I hate these kind of videos. Despite encountering some pretty terrifying stuff in this oh. previous video, there, he decided that he wants to wander back there again to see if this time things would be any different. They were but different. A little while off the video, things seem to be going quite well for Chris, who isn't encountering mm -hmm. anything downright scary right away. Yeah. But that all changes at around the 12 minute mark when this happens. Full minute mark. Oh, bro, that's creepy, dude. I will not live here. Oh no. I have no idea. This ain't abandoned places are so creepy. He's probably here, man. That's all I gotta say. What? What do I see? But if the creepy knocking noises weren't enough, Chris then proceeds to place his camera down on a desk, positioned nearby. And it's right here in which Chris accidentally records something absolutely bone chilling. What do you mean bone chilling? <sighs> oh, 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 oh my god! Oh my, oh my goodness! What is that? What is, what kind of creature is that, bro? Nah, bro. What kind of creature is that, bro? What kind of creature is that right there? Hold up. Hold up. Bro, nah, man, I'm I'm dipping from this abandoned place, bro. If I saw that, I'm dipping. No, I ain't trying to visit alone, dude. No, I gotta get some friends. I gotta get friends to visit, bro. I ain't trying to do this, bro. Nah. Oh, heck no, bro. Yep, he clipped something creepy. Yep, mm-hmm. Yep. Clipped it already. There you go. We got him. Did you see it? A man we did see it. passing by at the end of the hallway. What was this uh -uh. man doing in the building? Uh -uh. Was he simply trying to investigate the building as well, or did he have more sinister intentions? We will never know. True. Then about 30 seconds later, Chris finds himself in for even more scares. Oh, fellow shelter? Okay. All these deaths behind. Oh, he's getting closer. Oh no, you got a dip. You better not chase him, bro. Oh no, 
bro. Somebody's down. He definitely is close, dude. Before Chris can even get a chance to leave, though, things escalate rather quickly. Take a look at this. What happens? Oh no, something worse. Somebody's down. Manches. No man, just gotta run. No, 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 you gotta run, bro. You gotta run. I just saw something right there. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. You gotta run, dude. You gotta run. Somebody's here? Oh, they have guns. They have guns. You gotta run, G. They have guns. Oh, no. You gotta Some run, dude. No, nah, man. A man with a gun can be seen on camera, and gunshots oh. can be heard. Oh, no, nah, man. I think it's safe to say that after these horrifying experiences at the school, that this is probably going to be the last time that Chris explores the Robert Fulton school. Yeah. Can you really blame him? He don't want to take his risk of his life, bro. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, then subscribe for more scary content. My name is Sir Spooks, and I'll see you all in the next video. Yeah, guys, this has to be one of the most creepiest videos I ever watched. Dude, number one actually shook me so hard, dude, because the guy was blasted. I didn't know he had a gun, bro. He was literally shooting the innocent guy that was recording the place, bro. No, man, I will get out of that place, bro. If I saw the gun right there, I'm dipping. I'm dipping. I'm saying bye, bro. Nah, man. Why is he trying to shoot the cameraman, bro? Why? Bro, he was trying to investigate some scary stuff, and then all of a sudden, he just got in there and boom, that's it. He's done for. Yep. So yeah, guys, I'm glad I really did enjoy this scary video, even though I wanted to make this as a Wicked Wednesday still, even though it, it was kind of late because I did my series around Wednesday, which is the Black Ops 2. But yeah, guys, if you really did enjoy that, I'm really glad you did. And also, I'll see y'all in the next freaking upload.